everybody welcome back to my channel so beauty big bang has a few new items in their store that they sent me to share with you so i'm going to be showing you these items and of course remember i have my 10 percent off code which you see up on the screen i'll put it down in the description and you can go to beautybigbang.com to purchase these items and you can find beauty big bang on facebook and instagram as well so now I'm going to share with you what I have in front of me and to start with uh, Beauty Big Bang had sent me a manicure kit and so this of course is the box that it comes in the Beauty Big Bang on the side and then on the back it's about the product and it is saying that it is a nine piece manicure and pedicure nail set and in the set is two nail clippers one nail file one scissor one tweezer one dead skin fork one cuticle nipper one ear pick it looks like and one c and e pin and it is a hundred percent stainless steel so i'm going to open it up and share this uh, product with you there it is that's the case how pretty is that it kind of reminds me of maybe like a mermaid color very pretty we'll open it up oh i just love it love the feel of it it's so pretty so we're going to open it up, like I said, and check out the nine items that are in it. And I'll bring it up close so you can see. And like it said, it was they're all stainless steel. And there's on the other side. It's a very nice kit. This kit would be perfect to have in your nail room or even in your purse for that matter. It's always good to have some tools if you're needing them. So, and of course it says Beauty Big Bang on it. There it is up closer again, really pretty case. Okay, so I'm gonna share with you the next thing they sent me. It was a five piece stamping plate series. And so you would purchase all five of these and I'll just open them all up and show you what is on each one. And then once I get that done, I am going to do a nail art design with a couple of these plates. So the first one is a wood grain plate. I've actually been looking for one of these, so that's really nice that they have all the different wood grains on it. Okay, and so the second one is really pretty as well. More of a lace pattern, it looks like. So the third one looks like an arctic plate. It has penguins, polar bears, fox, really cute plate. So this one is a cat plate, so the faces are up nice and close, like tigers and lions and normal cats. Really unique plate. So this one is mainly a leaf plate, so that's really nice to have different types of leaves. So now that you've seen all the plates, I'm going to do a nail design right away. And the first plate that I'm going to be starting with is the wood grain. I have to try it out. So I'm going to be just removing, of course, the protective layer that they all come with, the plastic. And then we'll get started on my nail design. So there it is. Okay, so I'm going to start with a green color and I'm going to be doing two coats of the green color and I'll cure for 30 seconds each one. So on the next nail, I'm going to be doing a really light gray color and it's only going to need one coat and I'll cure that for 30 seconds. So again, I'm going to be doing the middle finger with that green and I'll do two coats of it. So I'll cure each one for 30 seconds again. So 
So on the index finger, I'm choosing this coffee color. And again, I'll do two coats of it and cure for 30 seconds. So now I'm taking the wood grain Beauty Big Bing plate and I'm taking a brown stamping polish and I'm going to stamp that coffee color on that index finger with the uh, wood grain. So I'm going to be using one of the other stamping plates and I chose the leaf pattern. I thought it would complement the wood grain well. So I'm going to be taking the one in the bottom corner and I'm going to be using a white stamping polish. And there it is. Look how well Beauty Big Bang plates, they always pick up well. I love all of their plates for that reason. So I'm going to transfer it on that middle finger. So I'm also going to use an image from the lace stamping plate. And I'm going to be doing the finger with the light gray. I'm just trying to soften the nail art design with this by putting this on that ring finger. So I'm purposely putting it down a little bit lower to leave, as you can see, a little line in between because I'm going to pull all the colors together by putting that coffee color in between there after I get it stamped. And I'm just taking that stamp again and I'm just going to apply that little bit at the top just to finish it off, as you can see. So I decided before I'm applying that coffee gel polish in between those lines, I'm going to apply a no wipe top coat just in case I need to straighten out the coffee color lines once I get them on. So I'm just going to take that color, like I said, and take a detail brush and just fill it in. And once I get it on, I'll just take my cleanup brush just to make sure it's nice and straight. And then we'll cure that for 30 seconds. So I decided I was just going to cover up the leaf design as well just so I don't mess it up when I'm working on the other nails. So I'll put that top coat on in here for 60 seconds. So I decided this nail just needed something else to tie everything together. So of course I'm taking that green and just kind of doing a little bow and then I'll cure that for 30 seconds and then I'll be adding a little crystal to the middle of the bow once I get it cured. So I decided the pinky needed something as well to tie it all together so I'm taking some gold and some of that brown that I used on that wood grain nail and I'm just doing that one little leaf at the bottom and then I'm going to transfer that onto the pinky. So as you can see I transferred a little more than I wanted to so I'm just going to take some acetone to remove that. So now I'm just taking my detail brush to draw a little stem and then I'm going to also be applying a crystal to this nail once I like, cure that for 30 seconds. 
Okay, so now that the design is done, I'm taking a matte top coat. I decided I wanted to matte them all, so I'm going to apply that to all the nails. And I'm going to go around the crystals with that and not get it on top of them because I will still want them to be shiny. And once I get all the nails done, I'm going to cure it for 60 seconds. Okay, now that they're cured, I'm taking some acetone to remove that dispersion layer. I really loved how this set turned out. I thought the stamping plates were amazing as usual from Beauty Big Bang. So use that 10% uh, off code if you're wanting to purchase and I'll have all the links down below. Thanks to Beauty Big Bang for sending me the plates as well as the manicure kit. I'm impressed with all the items that they sent me to share with you. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye. I'm just